So people are looking for all kinds of mechanisms to make alternatives to the fuel sources that we have now. Tobacco was, to us, a perfect one because it's not something that people eat. The infrastructure for growing it, harvesting it, producing it is all there. So we thought that that was an excellent uh, choice to make uh, fuels. Use of tobacco for cigarette products um, is decreasing here in the United States and in most countries. Uh, and so tobacco growers are looking for something else to do. Universally, the tobacco growers were very excited about the fact that there might be an alternative use for tobacco that might be looked at in a more positive way than using them for cigarettes. We've already developed an extraction method which allows us to take green leaves uh, and extract the oils because the oils will be in the sort of green outer portion of the leaf. This is uh, the total lipophilic extract from tobacco leaves. Uh, we have uh, modified the tobacco leaves so that they accumulate oils inside the air spaces within the leaf. And as part of the protocol that we developed, uh, we are removing all lipophilic uh, products, including the chlorophylls and the other colorful compounds, and that's what you're looking at right now. It can be used for airplane fuel, it can be used for automobile fuel, diesel fuel. So. I think it's doable, and so we think we will have something that's competitive.